Tonight, the problem's getting so bad, there's a new warning out to keep you out of the burn unit. ABC 15's Joe Bartels is live at Maricopa Medical Center talking e-cigarette explosions. And Joe, these scares are no joke. Yeah, see, they certainly are. And the survivor that we're focusing on tonight, she is still recovering here at the burn unit exactly a month after she was badly burned behind the wheel. In fact, she crashed because of it. And tonight, Tepe police releasing some pretty telling body camera video. 911, what is the emergency? Yeah, we have an emergency. A girl just got That was just the beginning of this terrifying ordeal. This black truck slamming into a tree back in April near Southern and McClintock. Now, new perspective. Witnesses stunned as a driver had to bail out. She's bleeding. She got ran over by the car. She's bleeding off her leg. Tempe police releasing blurry body camera video showing the chaotic moments after the crash. Officers rushed to the hospital with the victim to figure out what happened. Driving and then all of a sudden, like, it's like a firecracker right in my lap and I was like, oh my God. Police interviewing Melissa Madsen from her hospital bed. The 20 year old victim said her e-cig went up in flames without warning as she drove. So it's sitting between your legs or just sitting on your lap? Yeah, like it always does. Like that's always where I kept it. And I let it fall on the floor or whatever, but I was just like, then my feet started to seem like they were going to blow up. So I just opened the door and I just, just jumped, jumped out. out. Madsen suffered severe burns and pelvic fractures from her accident, but she's not the only one showing up to the burn unit with second and third degree burns from their e-cigs. Seen about a dozen patients over the last two or three months. So e-cigarettes are really becoming a big problem for us. And the victim here suffering uh, those surgeries as well as several skin grafts. And doctors here, in light of everything, are asking people to avoid e-cigarettes if they can. Reporting live in Phoenix tonight, Joe Bartels, ABC 15 Arizona.